Space. Final frontier. That's what it's called, right? It's beautiful. Endless. Feel the warmth of the sun millions of kilometers away on my skin without any atmosphere to stand between us. The upside is it's a truly amazing feeling. The downside is I'm truly about to die. Who would have guessed I'd die floating alone in space? You know, I mean, until now, I'd never been any higher up than the top floor of my apartment building, and I only went up there once. My mistake. It all started yesterday. Ordinary day like, like any other. It's un until I got hit on the head. Ouch! Jeez! That was a three-star impact, Wally. Uh, this one needs some work. Three stars? You sure, Ray? R&D insists that this one be a one-star hot hat. One and a half tops. That's some quality hot hats you're testing. You want to trade spots and see for yourself? Three stars. Didn't notice any birds flying around my head, though. Uh, that's something. All right. This one's next. It's a new material R&D wants to try. It says here it's based mostly on... Recycled banana peels and used juice boxes. Saved by the bell, huh? Oh, see you tomorrow, buddy. Hard hat tester. No experience required. It seemed like such a good idea at the time. This is Gamma 3. We've encountered storm systems too large to go around without delaying landing time. Uh, please advise. Gamma 3? Sean, you told me your name was Jimmy. Somehow I always forget how much jumping is required to get to and from work. Gamma 3 calling base. Please respond. Base, storm now intensifying beyond safety thresholds. Uh, unusually intense lightning activity observed. Attempting to abort. Uh, emergency support requested. Wow! Plane made out of paper can't take the heat, huh? Or even a little rain? I bet those eggheads you thought up a paper airplane was a great idea, because it wouldn't be detected by enemy radar. I'm feeling pretty smart right now. Tell me you didn't get him to redesign our parachutes, too! Mayday. Oh, Mayday! The lightning now at level 5 alert. The Omega level package is in danger. Repeat, the Omega level package... Son, I appreciate your concern, but my package isn't... Spaghetti arm doing sticking out of my head! Okay, stay calm, Ray. Last thing I remember was leaving work and jumping a lot and then getting it on the head. Of course! Uh, the hand growing out of my head and this whole crazy world is all a dream. Nice work, me. If I know my subconscious, this bottle will have something inside it to help me get off this island. Huh. 
high five me, Ray. High five me, Ray. I give the best high fives, Ray. High five me instead. Ray, you may think you know high fives, but you haven't experienced a high five until you've high five me. Please, please, crazy pin creatures, one at a time. I'll high five all of you, I promise. Why not, right? Might as well use this great. Whoa, this song is all. <laughs> oh, I'm almost sorry, I'll have to wake up from this. Hey, Ray. Look familiar. Oh, wow, no way! A giant me robot! Okay, so my head is flooded with elephant juice, and inside are a bunch of gears that aren't moving, which probably means I'm knocked out. And I need to drain the water from my brain. Got it. Help! Help! I can't hold my breath forever! Oh, and there's a creature swimming around in my head. Not sure what to make of that one, honestly. Uh, can you uh, hear me, little guy? Help! Help! A pink oh. elephant ah. pouring water through a hole in my head. Hmm. I didn't bring my dream symbolism app with- Hey, a sticker of a tap! I wonder if it's scratch and sniff. It is. And it smells like a sticker. Neat. There. I saved you, crazy alien creature thing. Finally dry at last. But the controls don't work. I need power. If only there was a way to get that heart working again. Heart, heart, come here, girl. I miss you. Weird. My girlfriend lives in Robot Me's heart, and she's calling for a dog named Heart. Dreams are crazy. Oh well, at least I'm not back in high school and also naked in this one. Again. <laughs> Oh, hey there, little guy. Uh, you're Hart, Arlene's dream dog, aren't you? How's it going, Hart? Oh, there's a good girl. In my day, I was the most feared pirate on all the seven seas. Bad news, buddy. You're just a figment of my imagination. And this is all a dream. You? Hi. It occurs to me that in real life, skeletons don't talk. Will you do an old sea dog a favor and dream me back to life again? Well, I, I kind of need to lead this dog back to my girlfriend. You've got an arm made of bone, so... I hear you, landlubber. Well, I'd be happy to lend a hand. Oh, <laughs> oh he just realized how well lend a hand worked back there. That wasn't even on purpose. <laughs> Heart?
Bert, you came back. What a good girl. Who's a good girl? It's you, Hart. You're the best girl. Yes, you are. <laughs> I'm so happy. I love you, Hart. I always knew Eileen was the woman of my dreams. But it's nice to have it confirmed. All the pieces are in place. I was just about to leave, but now I think I'll stay after all. Yes, I'll be able to stay here indefinitely, as long as the host survives. Wait, 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 what? Sir, there's been an incident. An incident? Uh, a crash, sir. And the subject is... missing. Why are you coming to me for instructions? Obviously, I'm going to tell you to find it. It's the most powerful weapon in the universe. Spaghetti! Sp spaghetti in my... M -m my hand! You think? <laughs> wow! What a crazy dream! Oh, good thing dreams are stupid and don't mean anything! You're awake! Perfect. That'll be a lot easier than carrying you out. Huh? What will be easier than carrying me out? This. Get out! What? Your insurance doesn't cover head injury, mister. Get out! Head injury? What? What happened to my head? Hey, hey, quit shoving! Oh, will you just tell me what happened to my head? Hey, 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 easy on the buns! Ah, this bandage is all kinds of itchy. I should just tell it to him straight. Oh, this can't be happening. Ouch! <laughs> Careful, I'm a So shiny. Become a so chef, they said. Your patrons are the door without it. Holy crap. What the hell? Okay. Okay. I'm hallucinating. Arms don't grow out of heads. I just gotta get home and sleep this off. It, it's all a hallucination, that, that's all. It's uh, just a hallucination that lets me... Hey, listen, do me a favor. I kinda didn't think this through. Obviously. And I left the handbrake on in the car. Can you disengage it for me? Uh, actually, maybe you can do me a favor instead. I'm looking for a cab ride home, and... I got my own problems here. Problems I do not want to talk about. Listen, thanks for nothing. I'm just gonna wait here till somebody else comes and disengages my car. Peace! Maybe... Uh, maybe I can use my... hallucinate... Barbara, if only you hadn't left me for that mafia don with the mad nutty <laughs> smile. If only my own smile had that sparkle that drives you wild. If only I could take back years of poor dental hygiene. If only I could have you back. I gotta find a way to help this dude get his lady friend back. Keep it up, Barbara. We'll win this competition for sure. Especially since my biggest challenger had an... Unfortunate accident? What? Uh-huh. What was that? Sorry, I was kind of lost in your teeth there. I just love your smile, Don. Uh, Don's my position, not my ne uh, You know what, uh, Don's fine. Honey, I don't care what you're called as long as you keep showing me those sparkly teeth. Good to be sure. here. Some might say that murdering a So that can't stop this dance train. I am an adult human and and how shiny their teeth are. I may have made some bad decisions somewhere. However, on the other hand, oh shiny teeth. Some might say that murdering a man to win a dance competition is sociopathic. Is it really sociopathic to only see people as obstacles to be overcome by any means possible? Hmm, wait, maybe it is. Maybe that's actually the textbook symptom of sociopathy. Oh well, 
Do it right now. Ed, where are you? <laughs> All alone and lost in the sewer. Nobody to tuck him in at night. Nobody to give him his belly rubs and his peep scratches. Why do you think I can't a soul? Who needs me to take care of him? Here, buddy. I've got your favorite. Chicken. 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 I'm nature's greatest predator, buddy. And I'm tired of chicken. I got a taste for special treats. And I ain't coming out for anything except human limbs, baby. Delicious human limbs. So long and crunchy. So full of valuable vitamins and minerals. I hate to see him hurt, but it had to be done, right? It had to be done. Rick, I suck, but I still care for him. I just wish everything didn't have to be so sucky. <laughs> what? Oh, I'm the noble heart here, Bricks. Oh, but you ended it. Good to be the <laughs> <laughs> this can't be real. Okay. I gotta be together forever. Forever! Oh, I can't believe our relationship is over. <laughs> 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 Buddy, it's this food is on. Funny, but it needs one more spice. Ingredient parfait! This meal, it is. Ah, oh, perfection! Perfection! You can really taste this sorrow. <laughs> Delicious, raw. Mighty! You came back! Come on, let me hug you for a bit. Laura and the kids will be ecstatic to see you again. They may show it by screaming at us and running away, but that's just their way. Gosh, Rachel's gonna kill me if I don't make it to the competition on time. Oh, well, she won't, because I'll already be dead. Because he's gonna kill me real soon. This is it, Dad. You're going to be dead soon, and you never went stab at him. You never ate candy. Yeah, and you never beat the Silver Surfer game for the NES. You're gonna die with regrets, Edo. Oh, if only I'd spent more time learning how to escape from chunks instead of learning the enemy attack patterns in the Silver Surfer for the NES. Although, honestly, I'm glad I spent so much time playing Silver Surfer for the NES. That game was tight. Oh, of course. You... I never forget a smell. Those are the jerks that tortured me every day. I'm going to I'm going to I'm going to I'm going to 
Uh, Beatrice? Where did you get those teeth? Uh, good doggy. Good doggy. Uh, <laughs> Carry me, Luigi. Carry me and then run faster, Luigi. Oh, gosh. Rachel's is going to kill me. Uh. Nice! And it's not too late for the competition. How can I ever say thanks? Well, I, I could use a drive. I've got it! I'll dance for you, and then we can talk about Silver Surfer. Ah, uh, for the NES? Aw, oh, man, I really want to talk about this, but I'm late. Ed! You made it! Where were you? Locked in a trunk, but this stranger wandered in and helped me out. Uh, it's been a good day for that, I think. Let's dance. An amazing set! First place goes to... Rachel and Ed! For their routine, Rachel's Education in Dance! This is an outrage! I paid good money to ensure my victory! Ah, I'm so angry, I could swallow my teeth! I could literally swallow my teeth! <laughs> I'll save you, Don! I'll save you, Don's teeth! so sparkly they feel good they feel right what am i doing here i need to go show barbara barbara i'm back and i got a mouthful to say to you bernie is that you you're so sparkly oh bernie where did we go wrong? We didn't, Barbara. Just forget it. Everything up to now is non-canon. Canonicity starts right now. Hey, thanks for the ride home, Bernie. Thanks for reminding me what's really important. Love. Sparkly teeth. Finally, just a few jumps away from home, where I can put all these hallucinatory spaghetti arms. Aline, I'm home. I've had the craziest day, honey. Uh, check it out. Think of a number between negative gazillion and infinity plus three. Bet you 50 bucks I can read your mind. Eileen, I know that the arm sticking out of my head looks weird. The what? Uh, the arm sticking out of my head. Uh, I know it looks weird, uh, but... There's it... no arm sticking out of your head. Ray, are you going nuts on me? Are you dropping insanity balls on the floor? No, I... Oh, I don't think so. You really can't see it? Sweetie, why don't you go see my shrink? Dr. Egglesworth helped me a lot. I'm not afraid of grapes anymore, see? Ah, oh, jeez. Maybe I am crazy. I guess it wouldn't hurt to see Dr. Egglesworth. I believe his office is over here, uh, to the right. Ah, that's him! He's the one who took your sacred thingamabob! I know because he has a stupid haircut. 
I don't forget a haircut that dumb. Agent 23 reporting in. We may have a positive on our target. Instructions. Hit him. Wait, is this real? Am I being chased by these jerks? Or am I really just going totally nuts right now? No, it's just so sad. Oh, Dr. Ecclesworth. I don't know how to keep your father so hard and far into deep depression. I'm glad you're seeing Dr. Brown. I'm also glad I'm paid by the hour. Keep as long as you need, Dr. Ecclesworth. Oh, he never died before. Later, possibly imaginary suckers. Dagnabbit! I'm dead now? Well, that's an inconvenience for me, but it's not going to shut down my practice. There's still tons of people out there who need lobotomies. Stay away from me with your lobotomies, man! Also, you're not as scary as I was expecting. I'm not scary. I'm a lobotomist. And it's the only way to cure what ails you, Sonny. A few cuts, a few slips, and you won't have a care in the world. When, when has talking about your issues ever solved anything? Action speaks louder than words, and that action is pulling out a brain parts! That's a chip point. Who loves digging six foot big holes? This is basically the perfect job for me. Except for the constant and only present threat of a spooky hole. Pretty sure. Those guys are snappily dressed. They're probably pretty smart. Maybe... Maybe I should mind read them. <laughs> Whoa! I should have not stayed up all night last night eating burritos. And yet I have no regrets about staying up all night eating burritos. I never... Ah. <laughs> well... Oh, man. <laughs> Sweet! This sticker makes him sleepy. Oh, I probably don't have too long until they wake up. Oh, this is heavy. I gotta get to that psychiatrist stat. Uh, excuse me, uh, doctor? Um, doctors? Dr. Brom, I can't go back to work. I just can't. Dad hated how I practiced my profession, and now that he's gone, we'll never reconcile. There's no closure left for me. I'll never be able to talk to him again. Mm-hmm. And how does that make you feel? Sad, I guess. Mm-hmm. And how does that make you feel? The sadness? No, oh, um, like, not happy? Like, I have emotions that are making me depressed. Mm-hmm. And how does that make you feel? Wait, how does that make you feel? Fine, thank you, but we're here to discuss you. Dang, I gotta help Dr. Ecclesworth so that he can help me. I gotta cure his depression stat. Yes, I have made contact with the spirit of your dear departed wife. I haven't departed anywhere. I can't move in the afterlife because my husband cut off my legs. Tada! Is she here? Can you ask her if she's mad that I cut off her legs? She's saying that she is, um, slightly frustrated by the circumstances. If I could touch him, I'd tear his legs off too! Yeah, definitely sensing some frustration. Back inside him! I, I, 
can't walk into the library anywhere else for that matter. Either someone needs to find us a knife, or someone needs to kill a wheelchair and send it to them. My way. After I apologize for getting off the rig, I should ask her if she knows where I put my rabbit. I haven't seen him for weeks. And rabbits don't just disappear. Oh, wait, no. I made him disappear and then couldn't get back. Okay, yeah, note yourself. Stop by a pet store on the way home. equal how amazing it is that ghosts really do exist. And How incredible that they all want to talk with my paying customers. At least this ghost knows our language. I'm so tired of being bothered by cavemen ghosts from thousands of years ago. Balloons for sale. Balloons for sale. I've t I like shapes and colors. Especially when they're shaped and weird. Sometimes I wonder if this is really what I was put on this earth to do. <laughs> Sometimes I get sad. The cookie was right. All right, round 37. Whoever has the shortest legs gets punched. Again. Ready, Gigator? Ready, Colossus? Ready, Little Jump? What? No, no! One, two, three, go! Wait, no, wait, no! Oh! oh my gosh, are they? Hey, Jace, Jace! They're about to pull off the rally scene, trampoline, trivets, maneuver! Ladies and gentlemen, this trick is very difficult to pull off. Let's watch. A complete success and a very painful landing for Little Jump. Ha! Poetry in motion. <laughs> Punches make me feel good. Normally people say. Hey, bully, I just said bad thing. But have they tried it? There's rules. Five. If my legs were longer, I wouldn't get punched. I could run away to freedom. I could follow my dreams of being in library school instead of this degrading show. Oh, it was worth a shot. Ah, jeez. The greatest show on earth. As long as you don't let us get the end, I'll Made a leaky, disposable balloon.
Man, I really should have looked low. Can I catch Ray? I'm gonna get a free speech. Dressor! I cut that gun 15 years ago, and it made me the man I am today! Huh.